Timer Pro on the uh, Android device could not be easier. You look for the icon on your uh, selections of icons. Of course, you'll have many around here. And then you'll do you tap the Timer Pro. It's going to open up the program. And the first thing you'll do is, is to select your template. And this will give you a listing of all the templates you have available. You can basically have an unlimited number of templates available. So you select the template you wish to use. In this case, I'm going to use my warehousing example down at the bottom here. And I'm going to click on the use. And um, now then what you do is you create a new study. If you wanted to create a new study, this would be this option here. And you give the study a name. So I'm going to call it, let's go touch it, and I'm going to call it um, August 23. Right? And that's going to be my study name. So I've added the new study there. I can go in and start doing the data collection here. I'm just going to click on the done at the bottom here. It takes me back out. Uh, we can open the last used study again, this option here. We can open an existing study, so if we select that, you'll see I have uh, yesterday's study, and now I'm working on August 23 here. Uh, you can also delete the uh, an existing study, and you can calculate the observations required. It's a very basic option. You type in the uh, average time you expect, the shortest time, and the estimated longest time, and it's going to give you a calculation of how many observations you need require for different degrees of accuracy. And to exit the... the uh, the program, you can click the end session down at the bottom here.